Hey guys, it's Phoenix, and this is another Redstone request. This one is going to be from a couple of people yet again, from Creative Ravine and Adam Cowan, and they suggested that I create force fields. So I've created a little bit of a, uh, a setup over here, and I'll show you that in a second. And this is an MC edit schematic you can import into your world. I'll leave a download link for that on my website in the video description. Anyway, just before I get into that, I just want to quickly touch on uh, puzzle number six. And uh, yes, it was incredibly easy, wasn't it? Um, but the point was that there are actually multiple solutions. When I uploaded it, I realized that there, actually more than, there was actually more than one solution. So um, you might want to go ahead and look for more than one solution that you've already commented. Um, but otherwise, I still think that video was a piece of cake. <laughs> get it? Okay, <laughs> I should really stop doing that. But I'm not going to. Anyway, let's get straight into this video. Alright, to start this contraption, you just have to press this button. And uh, if I can do that, there we go. Now I'm going to come over here and demonstrate how this force field works. And anyway, if you guys have any redstone requests you would like to give me, uh, don't forget to leave a comment on this video. So uh, let me get into survival mode and see if I can break these torches in one forward motion. So hopefully I can do that. Alright, now the mobs are going to start spawning. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to quickly eat this so hopefully you don't die. Alright, good. Alright, so this is how the force field works. Um, any th basically, uh, you can't die. But there is uh, one drawback from it, and that is um, uh, your health will start depleting. Oh, your not your health. Your hunger will start depleting over time, and um, that basically uh, denotes the amount of time you have. Uh, so you can always bring food to uh, basically uh, extend the time you have this force field. So I have a few more apples here. Basically, how this works is any mob near you will immediately uh, get killed, and. Uh, uh, no arrows can get you, no potions can hurt you, so uh, I can basically just stay here and I won't die. Press F5, you can see that I have a really nice little aura here going on. Um, it's like what you see in Dragon Ball Z, but a very uh, crappy version of that. So uh, you can see my hunger is actually going down. Let me just quickly well, <laughs> give myself some... Uh, I want to give myself some beef. Uh, let me give myself 64 of that. So I can quickly eat this to extend the time, and but otherwise you can see there's a really nice effect going on. Um, basically, it's uh, you can see a bit of a spell particle swirling around me um, in a very tilted uh, orbit, and um, I just have the basic flame particles. But otherwise, that's how the force field works. Um, basically, nothing can touch me. This will be very useful for PvP, combat PvP, maybe not range PvP because. Um, I mean, arrows can't get you, <laughs> but uh, otherwise this will be a really neat addition to PvP uh, gameplay, and um, I can quickly show you how this affects uh, the potions and arrows. So arrows can't get you, you can see that already, and potions can't get you either. So I can stand here and these are actually instant damage uh, potions, so they can't actually hurt me at all. So otherwise, this is how it works, and I can quickly uh, show you how the redstone functions. In order for you to cancel the force field, you actually need a bit of water. Yeah, I don't have a water bucket, so I can quickly get that and just place a bit of water down, and it'll stop the force field. And now you can get damaged again, like that. So let me just quickly eat some of this. <laughs> I'm very hungry. <laughs> All right, let me just go into survival mode, creative mode, not survival mode. Anyway, so this is how the redstone works. This is the uh, particle uh, effect. This is actually the orbits filter created by um, the brilliant Adrian Brightmore. And this line of redstone does the whole lot of it. So uh, there's a force field timer stat that uh, basically uh, measures the amount of time you eat a golden apple. And then it sets up a timer for you. And then the force field uh, activates in a way that it summons a creeper and destroys any mob that gets near you. So it's really quite a straightforward uh, mechanic, but um, it just looks really nice, and I really love the fact that I can now use the Orbis filter to basically enhance my um, concepts. It's really nice. So otherwise, uh, it's really simple. You just have to eat golden apple to activate the force field. But then again, um, it does have a few drawbacks, but otherwise it, it does hopefully enhance your uh, PvP gameplay and your survival gameplay. If you guys have any retina requests, feel free to leave a comment down below and Thanks for watching yet again, leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more creative content, and thanks for watching, take care.